as Richard has said, I work with the Serial Millers Association. Uh, we reach about 35 million consumers uh, with both wheat and maize products. One of the things that we've learned uh, about fortification, about food safety, um, first of all, I think our vision is really very clear. It's, it's that we need to provide safe, affordable, and nutritious food. Mm -hmm. Nutritious being key. Um, and also for us, food safety is non-negotiable. Uh, food safety, food fortification is non-negotiable. Over the, the years, we've learned that the only way you can do that is by really self-regulating. Uh, I don't think we're going to be waiting for government regulators to tell us what is the right thing to do. As private sector, we have a very important role to play. And it means that if we start self-regulating at our level, we don't even need to wait for people to come and tell us what is right and wrong. So one of the things that I think is most sustainable is as associations, as private sector, if we can build the capacity to self-regulate within ourselves, uh, ask for help when it comes to building our capacity. And thankfully, we have a lot of uh, development partners. Uh, you know, TechnoServe has been there with, this, with the CMA to help us to fortify. Um, and it has really built our capacity. It has also, uh, I think, increased our levels of fortification uh, substantially. So my, my opening, my key uh, takeaway would be, you know, please let's start doing the right thing as private sector. Uh, let's start investing in nutrition. Uh, let's do the right thing at all times. Thank you.